Hey, Bobby? What's up, Larry? I saw a tarp from the hotel in the jungle. So? What is that place? None of your business, and it has nothing to do with your faith. I have to be... Somehow I have the feeling that he's not all there. The buffet seems like a good nutrient base for the seeds. That's growing like a weed. Real organic fertilizer. Hey! Hey, did you have anything to do with this? Do I look like the kind of guy who'd be into greasy birds? To be perfectly honest? Yes, you do. How's the bird doing? It's covered in oil. It's covered in oil. You can get it out if you wash it at 90 degrees. <sighs> Have you, by any chance, seen a pretty blonde anywhere? I try to avoid people as much as possible. I try to avoid people as much as possible. Her name is Faith. Ring any bells? No. I'll let you mess around a piece, then. Okay, this will reverse the effects of the coffee. Enough. Now it's frozen.
Those can't be combined. Wonderful. A textbook Tiki Twister. Let's not forget what's in there, shall we? And you won't let anyone drink it. Of course I won't let anybody drink it. Uh, but if Becky... No. All right, all right. The buffet is now completely vegan. Yay! About time. I almost starved to death. You should eat small portions. Well, duh. Because of my intermittent fasting. I'm also doing a trigger warning for my followers from the Plants Are Living Beings community. They always get so cutely indignant when I take a picture of myself in a meadow. Okay, that's one more point on gulp. I have a selfie suitable cocktail for you. So cool! Wait just one minute, Buster. I'm not taking any more drinks from you. The bartender mixed it. Okay. That's all right then. But, uh, you, you better not drink too much of it, hmm? It's just for some fresh selfies. I can even suck on a straw without swallowing. I'm warning you. What? Now, I can give one more point on gulp. I have to go influence somewhere else now. Have you seen a pretty blonde anywhere? No. Well, apart from myself. <gasps> Don't you think that would apply to me too? Absolutely. I know those glow lights are from the festival. Were you there? I saw a whole box of them there. Exactly. So you were there? Yes. Everyone had to wear them. Nobody thought of getting lamps. It can get pretty dark at night, you know. And how was the festival? Awful. It wasn't galactic in the slightest. I wasn't able to find myself there at all and almost died of thirst instead. And no one gave me any money to continue my trip. There were probably a lot of other hot women in bikinis at the festival, right? No, there were only some pretty strange people. There were these totally disgusting guys who tried to hit on me. They were telling me about something called sleaze wars. <sighs> no idea what the hell that's all about. There must have been a blonde at the festival. Tall, slender, probably wearing a purple dress. Probably seemed a little confused. I'm pretty sure she had to have been there. Think hard. Mm, yes, there was someone. She was stumbling around like she didn't know how she got there. You remember where she went after the festival? I remember seeing her walking towards Crescent Cove. I never saw her after that. It must have been fake. She was in Crescent Cove. Pie? Yes. Bobby's nice, isn't she? Because... Oh! Oh... Pie? Yes? I like my raft. You did a great job, Larry. Did you just give me my first compliment? I do it all the time. Normally with sarcastic undertones. That's not true at all. 
Oh, give me a break. Hi? Yes. Somehow I missed because I have a lot on this. Hopefully, at least I'd. Hi? Yes. If you could drink, what would your favorite cocktail be? Larry, that's like me asking you what a woman would have to be like for you not to want to sleep with her. Oh, that's an easy one. If she. Stop talking right now. Hey, Bobby. What's up, Larry? Uh. So, how do you like the island? Uh, it's okay. It's a little old school, but uh, if only there was... I trained extra to be able to stick my... Uh, but this hotel, uh, I don't know, I gave it like an ultra-low rating on Gulp. I mean, it deserved it. Do travel bloggers really... Of course. That's how it should... After all, our commitment, as opposed to those bag packers, what a bunch of... I have to go influence somewhere else now. I prefer to stay on the observation deck. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Sex? No. We can use the telescope to look for faith. That's also a great idea. So, let's see. The island looks kind That's Gofuku Island. I wonder if the ring meets underwater. Nice island. I think that's Muffington Island. There's a lifeguard. It's plain to see that someone walked from the bay into the jungle. Small, dainty feet. I can see that. And there's an imprint of a round object. Hmm. There's something familiar about it. There's a clearing in the jungle. No, there's... No. That must have been the Galactic Festival. Those are glow sticks. I know I saw some of those somewhere else.
Not interesting. Not interesting. Quite an achievement hitting this particular little island. A ship sank there. The island looks kind of spooky. That's good. I don't know what kind of. Those birds can go to hell for all I care. There's a blue boat lying there, so it's at the beach of Muffington Island. A crescent moon-shaped bay. Somebody's been collecting garbage here. With a vengeance, too. I've seen that logo on those garbage bags somewhere before. Now, about Faith's whereabouts... Do you know what happened to her now? Yeah. Okay. We know for certain that Faith... Shawnee saw her there. True. She did tell us that. We can believe Shawnee when she says that she saw Faith. But what happened after the festival? Faith went to Crescent Cove after the festival. You mean the bay you can see from the hotel? But can you prove Faith was in Crescent Cove? Shawnee saw her walking towards Crescent Cove. But that doesn't actually prove that she was there. That's where her dress was. Only in her dreams. I found her panties on the beach. Stop bragging about it. Faith and I have a telepathic connection. In your dreams? Where else would she have been? I'm asking you. This... saw you collecting garbage in Crescent Cove. Yeah, and not just a bit either. It's considered a particularly romantic spot. You wouldn't believe the disgusting things I have to clean up there? Ugh, yuck. You mean you can spend a romantic night for two there? Yes, you can, but I always end up cleaning up the trash on my own. Maybe you just don't have the right company. You're more than welcome to help me. That is not what I meant. Then I'm not interested. Have you? I try to avoid. I try. Her name is. No. I. Yeah, and it's considered a. You wouldn't believe. Why is it called Crescent Cove? Maybe it's because it's shaped like a triangle? Oh, really? Who's kidding who now? I've been asking myself that for quite a while now. I saw you. Yeah, and not just a bit either. It's considered a... You wouldn't believe... I'm sure there must have been a woman there. I didn't see anyone. Did you find anything uh, unusual in Crescent Cove? Well, there is this. This is the puck that knocked Faith out. What? Oh, never mind. She must have had it on her and then lost it. Where did you find it? By the lifeguard station. I 
have to get... Hey, Bobby, what's up? The hotel now has its well-deserved five-star rating on Gulp. That wasn't so hard. Excellent. I have to admit, Larry, you're someone I can really count on. And uh, not just horizontally, huh? Speaking of which... Not now. I have to rework the marketing plan. This rating opens up a boatload of new opportunities. But as far as the fine is concerned... You can consider it paid. Thank God. To be perfectly honest... Yes? I just made up that whole fine thing. What? Why would you do that? Did you use me? So, tell me. When exactly did you feel used during the sex? But, eh, okay. Let's call it a draw. I have to be... Headquarters. Yes? Evidence is growing that this Larry is a top U.S. agent. Why? He must have undergone intensive chemical warfare training. He was able to mix complex chemicals to achieve the desired result. He could probably make a bomb of enormous explosive power from ingredients found in every kitchen. In North Korea, he would be a much sought after man, and not just there. Yanmai? Yes. Pull yourself together. Your target is face. Don't lose sight of that. We have to find that secret algorithm. Of course. By the way, do you still have any old contacts that could supply me with armored cars and flamethrowers? I can't think of anyone offhand. Why? Apparently, there are some who are not so happy with my new management style. Some of them want to go to extremes and form a labor council. The scum! I hate this city and my. Once I'm done with Prune, I'm going to be so happy to return home. Find Faith's algorithm. 